What do you think? You've got your harness on in there. You, you're going to just cruise around like that, do you? Just going to cruise around like that. So, well, what do you think? Hey, what do you think? Do you like it in there? Pretty comfy. I made it comfy for you. Yeah, well, you just get you used to being in there first. Yeah, be good, eh? Yeah, you've decided you like it in there, you don't want to get out. Is that right? Hmm? I've made it too comfy. See? It's too comfy for you. You don't want to get out now. Oh, it's nice, isn't it? It's a nice bed. It's a nice soft bed. I think you're too big. I think you're too big. Look at you, you big lump. Down, my good boy. Sit down. That's it. Yeah. Look at these. Oh, hey. Now you're gonna have to sit down. Hey viewers, Buddy, hello Buddy, Buddy's first adventure outside the backyard in the Ural, he's looking very excited, we're just going to take it very slow and easy, okay, good boy, we'll take it very easy for you, I'm going to put that back, okay, you keep your head down, and I'm just going to go out here very slow, and we'll see how you go. Put that forward so you don't hit your head. All right. Well, let's see. See how he goes. Here we go. Good boy. Got to get him some doggles, so have to be careful. You don't hit any bugs in the eye. How's that, mate? Good. He usually just goes to sleep in the car, so he should be okay. So this is his first trip. I hope he likes it his first breaking but I've got him tied back so he shouldn't um, have any drama dramas with me break I'm just worried about turning but if I just take it easy he should be okay he's got a bit of an injury at the moment he sliced his foot open running around mad in the bush so it's He's been stuck at home for two weeks. 
hasn't been out, not allowed to go for a walk. So the vet's happy with how it's healed, although he's got some tendon damage, so he's still got a very sore front right paw. So I thought I might take him to the bush in the sidecar, so he can have a little walk around in the bush, a bit of a sniff anyway. And he did his injury in the bush, running around like a mad dog. So there'll be none of that. It cost me 700 bucks to get his foot stitched up. Our first right-hander, there we go. How you going, buddy? You enjoying it? I think once he gets the idea that if we go on the sidecar, he can go and have a little walk around the bush. I think he might like it. I think he'd like to lay down. You've walked along here a few times. Do you know where you are, buddy? There we are. Oh, we had some big storms last night, so it might be a bit, a bit wild. seems to have well, settled the dust anyway. Now oh, he's such a good boy. You'll have to hang on when we come back up here, buddy. It's a bit bumpy. Just stop here, eh? There we go. You gonna hop out and have a look, walk around? Yeah. Because you're the best boy. The goodest boy, aren't ya? You're the goodest boy, eh? You gotta get on your lead. I can't have you running around because you've still got a sore leg, okay?
Buddy, buddy, what is it? What did you think? What is that? Me? What is that? No, stay there. Good boy. Recording. Come on. Up. Up. Boy. No, come on. You gotta go up. Oh, no. in here. Now, don't run around. Come on, up. Oh, I'll pick you up. Oh, wait. Get your tail down. Uh, you gotta sit down. Come on, sit down. Sit down. You gotta sit down in the sidecar. There you go. That's a good boy. Okay, so we made it. Now we're going to head back. We've got to get up the rocky bit of the trail. I hope we can hang on there. How'd you like that, buddy? You all right? Was that good? Was it good? You got to get out out of the house. Good boy. Okay, here we go. Might better just roll back here. And up the up the little hill here. Okay, hang on, buddy. Hang on, mate. Good boy. Whoop. This will be a big test. We can get up here. Oh, good boy. No dramas. He's so cool, calm and collected, but he's like he's been doing it his whole life. <laughs> Nothing phases him. He's a very, very placid dog. Unless there's a lizard or a wallaby. And he's a different dog. So that's it buddy, you've, you've been down the bush and the Ural test track and everything. What did you think? Watch out for the trees. <laughs> yeah, sorry mate. I should have warned you about the trees. Watch out for this tree. Watch your head. Good boy. That's it. It's alright. On now. We'll be back on the road soon. Just got to get home without you falling out. Mm. So, thoughts so far? Well, he's, he's very high. I've uh, left the, the plastic bucket of the seat in there and just taken the seat out made the, the floor for him. It's all supported and secured under the seat so it doesn't won't come up in a hurry. 
must be roll a sidecar or something, but then we're in trouble anyway. There's a corner. Good boy. So we can take that out and look, he's getting a bit lower in the sidecar would be better. I don't know how involved it is to take the plastic bit under the seat, under the seat, the under seat storage part out. Let's have a look at that. It's an easy way to pop that in and out. I could do that. Then he would sit a bit lower. He's such a tall, tall dopey dog. Anyway, home. Home and have a treat, eh buddy? There's the horses. <laughs> Come on. Sit down. Sit down there. There you go. Stay there like that. And the horses, eh? See the horses, they're running away. What are they doing? Well, we made it home safely. We made it home, buddy. What do you think? What did you think of that? You're not saying much. Just wait there. There you are. What did you think? Anyway, I wasn't going to leave you there. Mind my gloves. Last little bit into the shed. I love my dog as much as I love you. My dog will always come through All he asks from me is the food To give him strength All he ever needs is love And that he knows he'll get So I love my dog As much as I love the you The you may fade My dog will always come through all the pay I need comes to shine through his eyes I don't need no cold water to make me realize That I love my dog as much as I love you Do you may fade, my dog will always come 